today's video I am currently still in my pajamas <laughs> but I actually did just get back from a walk I didn't go out like this I had sweats on and then I got really hot and then I put my PJs back on but I am currently getting ready to go hiking so excited this is gonna be the second hike of the year you guys saw the first one it's a great workout great just steady state cardio nice to get out in the mountains they just make me feel so grounded and alive and they look massive and beautiful and clear today so I'm stoked I actually am gonna do a full day of eating as well because we're going to be on the road I'm gonna bring snacks I'm gonna show you guys what I'm gonna eat starting with this breakfast sorry I don't mean to keep changing the lighting this breakfast you guys is new it's a new one it's different I know, I know, wow. I finally switched up my breakfast and I'm liking it. So here I have some Japanese sweet potato with some almond butter on it. You see how that melted on it? Oh my God. Fresh raspberries, okay. Even right there, like I'm a happy woman. And then I'm eating two full eggs. Bam, comment down below. If you think that this looks delicious too because if you do we're probably best friends in real life and if you don't you're kind of weird <laughs> and then I always take vitamins in the morning with the first meal I don't like to take it on an empty stomach just because it can irritate the stomach so I'm taking the woman's multivitamin been loving incorporating this focus How cute is the packaging too? And it actually tastes like berries. It's awesome. And then I'm gonna be taking omega-3s because we are actually likely most of the time deficient in omega-3s and have a lot of omega-6s. So if you guys aren't already taking an omega-3 supplement, it's awesome for heart health, brain health, cardiovascular health, and reducing inflammation in the body as long along with your joints. So there we go. Let's eat, and then I'll show you guys what I'm packing to go. Okay guys, I am ready and dressed and ready for the mountains. I already said that, my hair is so static -y right now. Thin hair problems. <laughs> okay, so today's outfit of the day, I got this. This was actually in um, my Fashion Nova haul. Yeah, I got it from Fashion Nova. And you can dress it up or dress it down. I like to wear it with a sports bra underneath it when I'm dressing it down. I just think it looks cute and chic. And then I'm wearing some Gymshark uh, dreamy shorts. And you guys, oh my God, not sponsored. I've been buying a lot of Gymshark and uh, Lululemon lately because I want to add color to my closet. But yeah, you guys, I'm like comparing these two right now. These are the lines. These are the dreamy. I don't even know if it's possible. But the Gymshark are a little bit softer than the Align leggings. Ah, they're amazing, honestly. These are a size small. I would size up though. Just they're a little bit snug in the waistband. I would like a little bit more room if I was to get bloated because these would be very uncomfortable if I was bloated. <laughs> but that is my outfit of the day and just a Lululemon sports bra. And this is what I'm packing to bring to the mountains. So this bag, I have to tell you guys about this bag. How cute is this bag? Right? It's actually vegan leather and it's blue. It's so stylish, so cute, very high quality. Um, my girlfriend Lady Hammer is her Instagram, and it's her name's Stephanie. She actually did a collaboration with this um, brand. It's called Linnell, and it's amazing. Like I said, it's vegan leather. It's such amazing quality. I'm so proud of her. She sent me this, and I'm just stoked on it. I'm going to be bringing um, my One Up Nutrition vegan protein. There's protein powder in the bottom. We got some chocolate there. You guys, I got a goodie bag sent to me from Little Tucker YYC. If you are in YYC, you know how good this is. It's absolutely incredible. My favorite, favorite, favorite is 
the Little Tucker's Snickers bar. Unreal, I'm saving this. These are the ingredients and these are the macros. This is like my favorite thing on the planet. If I was to have one last thing before I die, honestly, it would be this. Okay, so these are the cookie dough balls. I'm excited to try these, I haven't tried them yet. And the nutrition is absolutely amazing. So I have some of those. I also have some lychee, bringing those for Stella and I. And then this protein bar if I get extra hungry. So that's what I have. And my friend Stella is packing us like a quinoa tabbouleh salad because she's amazing. So I'll show you guys our lunch. Let's uh, get ready to hit the road. A quick snack. I just spiraled one zucchini and I made this dressing, you guys. I'm actually super, super proud of it. So I'll put the ingredients on the screen. It's going to be like a zucchini linguine with avocado pesto let's just call it an avocado pesto sauce homemade hell yeah and then just a little bit of salmon that i have left over so i'm going to eat this just because i know i'm going to be on the road and probably not going to eat uh for a little while anyways checking in with my girl about an hour later hi Stel. <laughs> so we are currently at the gate of banff waiting to get our pass it's a pretty busy day beautiful day since we're gonna be in Lake Louise for five hours. We definitely need it. Wanted to show you guys that I got some egg white bites, the roasted red pepper. I'm just a huge fan. And a decaf almond milk latte because I didn't need the caffeine. But that's just my little like road trip thing. I love it. I actually do get it pretty I much know. every time yeah, I Yeah, you get it every single time we're on the road. An yeah. almond milk latte one way or another. Yep, and now that the egg white bites are here in Canada, Roasted red pepper, wow, roasted red pepper, guys, they're really good. And as we were waiting here, Stella and I just had the uh, the cookie dough bites, and they were bomb. What's the brand called again? Little Tuckers. Oh, they're so good. I know. Yeah, it's so I yummy. I know, I know. So good. So, yeah, we still have about an hour and a half, two hours. An hour. An hour. An hour. Nice. Park, yeah, okay. depending on how you drive. We will see you when we get there. We just arrived in Lake Louise, but we are hungry, so we're eating the salad that Stell made for us. And it's like a quinoa tabbouleh salad with avocado. We got some cucumber in there, some tomatoes. What else? Parsley, uh, fresh mint, onion, mm, lemon juice. Smells so good. Salt, pepper, that's it. Yum. A little bit of apple cider vinegar too, just to amp it up, but. How good does that look? I know. So we're gonna eat in the car first and then we're gonna start the hike. <laughs> that you hike up to. You told me, oh my God. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> We're gonna go to the beehives now. The big beehive. What do you think of the lake, Randy? Like, I can't believe that this is real. This is no filter needed. This is so crazy. How is it that color? Mother Nature. Pretty. Wow. This is the beautiful, most beautiful hike I've done in Alberta. Yeah, me too. Yeah. It's the most scenic. It's not the most difficult. No. No, it's definitely the prettiest though. Wow.
23,000 steps, 15 kilometers. Oh my gosh, my feet are so sore. And I am so glad that I have some of my vegan chocolate protein right now because I've been looking forward to this for like an hour. <laughs> What's up guys? We are back home and wow, that just kind of, did, did that seem like the longest car ride ever? Yeah, it was pretty long, <laughs> uh, but it's still like two hours away. Now we are home. Honestly, we are having a, this one's mine, a little glass of wine just to celebrate such an amazing day. Just, it's a beautiful day to be alive. Something nice and cold and refreshing waiting for us. So we're having a glass of that. I'll show you guys. This is actually, if you're interested, the first time that we are drinking it. 689 is actually one of my favorite red wines red wines so this is the white and we're going to be making dinner so i didn't want you guys to miss out on this because we're using the air fryer and if you guys want this i bought it at indigo online and it was only 75 dollars when you ship it to the store and it's amazing it's amazing so we're going to be making some Roasted cauliflower bites. I just have a bunch of cauliflower heads here. Cut them up smaller and I'm putting the buffalo red franks on it. I'll show you guys the rest as we do it. All right, so dinner is served. I made these balsa fillets last night and you guys, this is the power of meal prep. I only had to cook the veggies and I didn't have to wait for the longest thing to be ready so that is why I'm such a huge fan. So we have some balsa there, we have some sautéed zucchini and mushrooms with some sesame seeds and garlic and chili flakes and then we have the cauliflower bites and half of an avocado each. Looks so good! Yay! So and Stella is helping me edit something that I'm so excited to share with you guys. So stay tuned for that because it's going to be good. Stopped what we were doing for a split second and came outside to appreciate the sunset. What a perfect day. All right, guys. So that is it. That's all. Stella just left and I am so, so pooped. I just put castor oil on my eyelashes. That is something that I started doing. And it's so thick that I like it kind of blurs your vision. <laughs> but it's supposed to be really good for eyelash and eyebrow hair growth. So if you guys have ever done that before, then comment down below and give me some hope because right now I can't really see and I'm just hoping that it's gonna work. <laughs> but I think that that is going to conclude this video. It was a full day of eating. And I did eat everything that I packed. Uh, I drank my shake. As you guys saw, we ate those lychee. Loving lychee lately. Shared that protein bar, nectarine. Stella did bring a nectarine. We shared that. The salad. I had my little linguine before I went. My breakfast. And then we had that fish meal when we got home. So that is a day of adventure. Food on the go staying on track and ending with a glass of wine. That's balance if you ask me. <laughs> if you guys ever have a chance to go to the Rockies, I would highly, highly suggest it because it is hands down one of the most beautiful places that I have ever been in my life. Comment down below where the most beautiful place is that you have ever been because I wanna know. I'm gonna add that to my bucket list and your favorite hike. I'm curious to know. <laughs> Thank you guys so, so for much so so much for watching i appreciate every single one of you guys i really truly do thank you so much for taking the time to click on this video and hang out with me if you guys did like it and you wanted to support the video and me please give the video a thumbs up subscribe and i will catch you in the next one i'm going to the gym tomorrow i don't know what i'm going to train yet but you guys are going to see that when i post it <laughs> see you next time guys